Hey, I'm back to do a Pisces reading. I'm eating a gummy bear candy. But last time I tried to do this uh, reading, it was just very negative, so I trashed it. So we're going to try again. Um, so this is taking a look at August for Pisces. What may um, be some guidance that you need to take away from this. Um, situations that may occur. So that's what we're going to... I can't shuffle. I'm trying to shuffle like the pros. Okay. Off the bat, we have protection. We have truth. And standstill. And at the bottom, we have patience. I saw this earlier, but it's back again. So... <clears throat> Pisces for August, going into August, I feel like you're going to have to protect yourself from some type of truth that's going to be revealed or that's going to be coming to light about a situation. Um, this situation asking for you to be patient with yourself and just allow things to happen naturally with this standstill card. Um, with the first card being protection coming out, it's kind of like you have to make sure that you're good emotionally and physically. Because I feel like this truth is going to be something that is going to turn your world upside down. <clears throat> and both protection and truth have this tree that's like in the middle of nowhere, basically. Yeah, something's going to be revealed. And it could be something dealing with um, some type of ending of something. Because <clears throat> somebody is blowing and it's like dead. It's like breathing life into something. So some type of... This might be like something that you're needing to be able to move on. Some type of truth. And with this protection, it's kind of like saying that you are going to have to protect yourself from whatever this outcome is. <clears throat> Maybe you're going to learn the truth about somebody. <clears throat> and it may be something that you've already known. Right, we have hold your vision the answers you need are coming full moon and gemini and communication is key new moon and gemini so you could be dealing with the gemini um possibly at the bottom we have your dreams need a practical plan so it's kind of like you're trying to prepare yourself for whatever this truth is that's going to be revealed um, this person is going to come out and tell you something or somebody's going to come out and tell you something 
and it's kind of going to answer everything that you've been either feeling or wondering up to this point and with the hold your vision it's basically trying to say that remember that you're what matters in this situation so no matter what you hear whether it's what you like or don't like you have to make sure that you're prepared for what's going to be coming your way so august for pisces is going to be all about <clears throat> protecting yourself and finding answers answers being revealed to you about a situation so let's see what that situation is gonna unfold here So we have despair. We have poverty. We have child. We have courthouse. We have change. And we have official person. And at the bottom we have coffin. So. So I feel like there's going to be some situation um, that's headed towards August that's going to result in some type of loss of something. Um, this is kind of how it was going on the original one. The one that I did before that was negative. Um, kind of has some of the same tones, but not as negative as that was. Um, but basically, I feel like you're going to be um presented with some type of situation that you're going to lose out on something um it could be something dealing with a custody battle but it's going to be like a drastic change and it's, it's pretty much nothing you can do about it because it's going to be a decision made by somebody that is um like above everything it could be a judge or something of that nature um we have child here so like i said it could be some type of child custody it could be somebody's, um, you know, childlike ways have caused them to be in this situation. So take that however you feel. But I'm kind of leaning towards some type of loss related to something dealing with the legal system. Because we do have courthouse here, an official person. So, and change in between those. So I feel like there's going to be something. And the despair is over protection. So it's kind of like whatever the situation is that you are going through or what will happen is going to cause you know a feeling of loss or feeling like you are like defeated and i feel like that's why it's saying to protect your emotions and your your physical and mental space because you know this situation could cause all types of you know issues um we have truth and that's uh that is being clarified by the poverty card so there could be something coming out about a loss of some sort or somebody not having money there could be something dealing with money that's affecting the situation maybe because um, i'm really not getting a sense of who this person is whether it's you or somebody else in your inner circle maybe you're dating somebody and they portray themselves as having all this money and they actually don't have much and you may have a child with this person and realize didn't realize that you know maybe they're being sued by somebody you know you're gonna have to leave your home you know there could be anything there's gonna be some type of ending um so i don't know if you're gonna leave this person or it's gonna cause you to leave but at the bottom we actually have coffin family room and courtship so it could be an ending of a relationship and it's going to cause the ending of a relationship uh rather quickly um there's also main female privileged lady so there's somebody here that 
uh, could be a third party in the situation and you were kind of unknowing of what was like occurring. This person probably pre presented themselves as being single, you know, having it like that. And you may have taken a chance on them and didn't realize that they have all this drama that's going on behind the scenes. You know, child issues, child custody issues, possibly somebody going through a divorce that you may not have known about. And I feel like you're going to receive information about this. Like the truth is going to come out about this situation. Yeah. And you're going to find out stuff that's going to, and I kind of feel like maybe you might already know this stuff or you might feel like something's weird. But it's going to lead you to making a decision. <clears throat> and I think what is being asked of you is not to do anything. Because I feel like if you get involved in this situation, then drama is going to come your way. And I feel like you just need to let things play out and follow your intuition and leave a situation if it's not something that is, you know, serving you at the time. We have King of Cups in reverse. Somebody's going to let their emotions out. They're going to not hold things in. Because the King of Cups in reverse is clarifying despair and protection. So it's kind of like it's asking you to be careful who you release your information to or discuss things with. Because this person may not have your best interest at heart. So I feel like with the protection being the main card... You have to protect yourself from other people feeding off of your um, your downfall, if that makes sense. Because some people like that because it makes them feel better. So I'm, it's just basically saying that you have to be prepared to be careful, or I'm sorry, be careful who you release your emotions off to, who do you who you show vulnerability to. We have Page of Pentacles, and that's um, clarifying truth and poverty. So, like I said, this is somebody that's possibly, like, immature. Like, they had all these fantastic ideas, wanting to start something. And underneath it all, they were not being honest about their situation. They could have been hiding things, acting like they had money, acting like they had it all, when really they didn't really have much to offer. And they were just going off of what they wanted you to believe. Go ahead. Two cards. Okay, I'm not going to take that because I only want to take two cards. We have two of cups. And this is clarifying child and standstill. So this could mean that somebody was immature about how they cared about you. Because with the child being there, it's kind of like, you know, a childlike innocence, you know, somebody that's not really developed yet to know right from wrong. Um, and if we're dealing with adults, obviously they do. But the men mental mindset is this person had offered you love or had offered you something that they weren't able to provide because they weren't at that level. They may have tried to act like they were on the same level as you. And it's kind of like with the standstill being at the bottom, they're trying to tell you that you have to be still, let this person show you their true colors so you can make a decision. So it's kind of like you may have started to see that this person was like childlike, um, started to see little hints here and there that they weren't actually in it for the long haul and they were offering something that they weren't even providing properly. We have seven of pinnacles and this is a clarifying courthouse and hold your vision. So I feel like somebody feels that they put work into something and it just didn't pan out. 
So this could be you feeling like you put a lot into the um, relationship and frustrated that it's not ending the way that it's supposed to. Because courthouse also can be about like, you know, some type of finalization, something ending, like a very like direct ending. And this person could have been, if you're dealing with somebody, the person could have been like not pleased with their living arrangements or their marriage or whatever. And so they're deciding that they want to end it, but it's turning out to be possibly messy. So take that however, but somebody is not pleased. They don't feel like something's enough. Maybe this person feels like you're not doing enough, but it's possibly because they don't have anything and they expected you to kind of like take care of them. Um, we have eight of pentacles and this is um, clarifying change and the answers you need are coming. So I kind of feel like you're working hard to try to uncover what this truth is because you're, you may be the type of person that wants to get all the facts first before making a decision because underneath that we have change. So it's kind of like you're putting in the work to find out what it is this person's hiding, what is their truth, what is like, what is it that they're trying to explain to you and you're just becoming like kind of obsessive over it and I feel like like I said earlier, you already kind of know what's going on. Yeah, the answers you need are coming. So maybe from your hard work of trying to figure this out, you're going to receive the information. Like I said, some type of truth coming in. All right, we have Ace of Wands, and that's clarifying official person and communication is key. So that could actually um, mean that it, gonna this situation is going to lead to you finding someone else or someone else coming in. Um, this person is going to be passionate. They're going to be able to communicate with you. Like, you're not going to have these issues. So I kind of feel like that's going to be the end result of this troubles that you're going through with this other individual. We have six of cups. This could be somebody from your this could be somebody from your past or dealing with the past situation. I really don't get like full on love with this. I do feel like in the process that you are gonna, you know, end up moving on from this situation, kind of like a lesson learned. Yeah, four of wands in the reverse, like kind of freeing yourself from somebody that you thought was the one for you. Yeah, eight of wands in reverse, not moving forward with the relationship you're currently in anymore because of all the lies. Yeah, the chariot in reverse as well. So you're not looking to move forward with this situation at all. Yeah. And the Knight of Pentacles is on the bottom, so it's kind of like you're not going to move forward with this childish like individual because all they do is bring drama into your life and they don't really have anything to offer offer you so i think moving forward you are going to meet the official person or somebody that you are in line in tune with and you guys are going to have proper communication there's going to be passion there um and this is probably just the stepping stone you know, you realize that this person wasn't who they said they were. 
you found out information and you just don't want to be part of that drama so i'm going to end this one here um pisces so if you guys like that please let me know um comment subscribe if you like and um i'll catch you guys in the next video